how to create a Google Lead Form extension. In this video, I'll show you step by step how to create, how to add headlines and so on to that particular extension. So stick around. But first, let me introduce myself. My name is Yevgeny Chonao and I'm CEO and founder of Discover My Business. I have been running successfully Google Ads for almost seven years. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video so everyone who needs to help with this extension will see this video on the first page. So let's go to the actual page. Uh, on the left side, you can click campaigns, pick one of your campaigns over here. We will use uh, our demo account. Then go to extensions, add extensions. Uh, this page will be pop up over here. Click a plus sign um, and you will see lead form extension. Click on this one. So right now we need to, before we start anything, as you see, we don't have right now any forms. We want to create actual form. So uh, Google allow you to have call to action, apply, book now, contact us, get offer, get quote, or learn more. And as the examples, I'll move myself out here. You can see this form on the mobile devices, like how that will form look like. And sometimes, depending on the services, depending on the businesses, we will use a learn more or actually apply now or book now. So for example, we are a digital marketing agency. Uh, I will use book now and type free $300 audit. Free $300 marketing audit so as you see uh, this is the headlines and this one is a small description offer the next one is create your lead form uh, again in this we just mentioned the headline we can skip the headline and business name we'll put discover my business and small description about the company full service digital marketing agency okay so this one is description we can place the headline or we can skip we prefer to just uh, skip headlines this moment questions uh, as always we're using name we're not subdivide by first and last name because it's kind of sometimes not detecting the last name we're using full name in one section then you're using phone number email uh, zip code so we know kind of where's this prospect coming from uh, and also company name again it's b2b company name if not we just skip it and also we want to know like a custom question again this is our business if you're a dentist you can skip and do your own ones and the question side as you see you can pick from google they allow you to pick like uh, q a over here what is your size of the company so it kind of goes to pick qualification of your prospect again we're not using this um, we're kind of trying to manually manage everything then also as you see we need a privacy policy make sure your website have one if you if you guys don't have any privacy policy you just can enter a basic url from your corporate website and it will work fine my business uh, I believe we have <laughs> yeah we do have so we will use this URL we'll enter it here background image right now as you see on the contact form site we don't have any image out there so we will probably add something from our recent you can enter logo actually um, or you can use any other things we will use logo in this moment oh it's not fitted back to the results let's pick as example this one select save so over here we see actual background of the image scroll down then create form submission message so it will be over here it's kind of a thank you page we use send and description uh, we use from the thank you page thank you for submitting contact form we will contact you shortly with you 
sure. visit website and we can send them to specific page with a case status so they can see what that what we're actually doing you can visit our website for case studies okay and in the next video i will explain you how to create a webhook for uh, your form extent lead form extension i will help you to create a webhook i will help you to create keys so in the next video i will place on the top or in the, on the top um, you can click on the video and watch this exact video how to integrate your lead form with your crm that's it click save uh oh my bad headline let me switch from description <laughs> that's strange sorry guys and i took all of the information from our corporate website like here click save and that's it this is how you add and your a lead form extension to your campaign level if you have any questions about google ads please let me know uh, click link below to schedule a free consultation with me and don't forget to subscribe and like the video thanks bye